Okay, um, we're back playing uh, Bionic Doos. And uh, one of the things I find interesting, of course, you can zoom in and out uh, to get a little better handle on where you are, where you gotta go. Um, there, uh, this game is turn-based, but you know, when you move, it's almost as if you're moving in real time. So when you actually make a movement, your that it is a turn base you know it's not like if you stop moving it's not going to continue to move um, things around you are not gonna stop too like the enemies um, but every time you move they're allowed to move so if you move really fast like this they're making all kinds of maneuvers in the background where you might not see them there is an interesting sort of line of sight uh, fog to this game So this basically you're just trying to kill the enemy. Now I wouldn't get the idea that this is easy. I uh, <laughs> and of course there's there's lots of sort of funny stuff in it. Um, these are just mines on the floor which you can kill. Sometimes it's kind of fun. I do have limited ammo though. So even though they're laser, you do have limited ammo and limited ammo for your machine gun. So you you might want to be sparing with that. Um, and you have specialty robots. So this is, this is robot is an assault, so pretty good at shooting and stuff. But you might want to switch to your science robot when you get to the computer, so you can hack the robot. You can so you can hack the computer, which I just did right there. And then I might switch to my siege robot. Um, you know, each one of them has different weapons, and you just click on the one that you want. Maybe you want uh, his missiles, and uh, to just sort of clear out a room here. You know, uh, just kind of fun to do. You do only have limited ammo on this, so you might not want to go around shooting them all day long. But... Blowing things up is always fun. So, when you... Open a door, so you go in a room, there might be something in there that you might want to use later. So, once you've sort of cleared out the room, then you got to find your, hel your, your pad to get out of the room, your, like, transport pad. There's my transport pad. And there's my transport pad, but... Of course, you have to kill everybody in here, so that's why it's not letting me get out right there. See this little thing here? That's the explore. You have not explored, but need to. Kind of symbol there. Um, I think the overall feel of this game is good. Um, it's difficult. I mean, it doesn't seem like it here. But it's it's uh, it's harder than it looks, I guess is maybe the way to put it. Okay, now I think I've blown everything up. I need to blow up. Uh, I should be able to get out of here. Nice work. So I've completed a mission. Uh, you know, and you just kind of keep going. Each mission has different, uh, different t styles of things. That was to just destroy everything. And this will, like, this one might be uh, a dig out. Uh, this is another destroy all. The, let's see, some of these are like sneak around. The fabricating parks will capture, capture things. Um, you can customize your. Your, uh, I'm gonna say 
your assault robots, I guess. Um, so I'm going to have to get that term down, huh? All right, so yeah, so then you click on this and you click click on it and then click click on it. Oh, I've unequipped those. So see, I can put that on there and it's put it's created my stats. They do have like a lot of power stuff. It's you know, it's pretty intense as far as uh, knowing, okay, all right, I get shields, but that consumes so much power. So now I you know might not have so right here power usage is 10 but you might be way over that you know, like if you add something else that um, ah so I'll add this right here and you can see my power usage went back up uh, you know I, I really actually I like this game quite a bit and then you can go back to the city map and go continuing adventuring again I, I think there's a lot to it there's a, a lot of nuances to it I think these are the robots that are out there the enemy robots there's a lot to the game um, it's pretty hard though the first few times I've played I lost I me mean, you have like 50 rounds to complete the mission which it, it, you know and uh, I failed <laughs> so uh, overall I give this game a thumbs up I'm gonna enjoy playing it for many hours after this uh, this uh, uh, poorly worded review so all right talk at you later